Welcome back. You know, after a tough week of games that saw the champion Aces lose two games in the same week for the first time this season, reigning MVP Asia Wilson still find time to visit Mayweather Fitness for the kiddos and took time to chop it up with me about their upcoming four game roadie and more. Not a bad exclusive interview with Asia Wilson. Check it out. I'm here with Asia Wilson. Everyone knows who Asia is, obviously. We're here at Mayweather Fitness. You guys are giving away book bags. You guys are, you, you meet a lot of fans out here. I guess the fact that you get a chance to give back, I'm sure that's something that you enjoy doing very much. So. Yes, for sure. I mean, and also these children are our future. So if we can do anything to help them bring back and understand that we're here to support them through whatever they want to do, whether it's boxing, basketball, everything in between. Um, I love it. I love being here supporting it. And definitely these book bags are pretty nice. So I, I'm super glad that they could have them. Now, I saw the big hug that the little girl gave you when she came in. That, that can't get old. Never, never gets old. I mean, that is my why. Those are my reasons why I continue to be who I am uh, as much as I can, as much as I can be seen with these young people, particularly young black girls that look like me, to give them an opportunity to, so them, they can see, like, no, I can do this. Uh, it's so It makes my heart warm up every single time. So, no, it never gets old. <laughs> got you. I got you. I got to ask you a couple yeah. basketball questions. Yeah. One. I mean, obviously, you guys just had the game last night. Yeah. You guys had the Commissioner's Cup a little bit ago. You guys got a huge road trip coming up. Yeah. I guess your thoughts on getting ready to get out of Las Vegas and going to like a real monumental road trip towards the end of the season. Yeah, I'm actually really excited. Hopefully, you know, Mandalay, the, the rims kind of had a lid on them this, off, this this basketball game. So hopefully when we get into a change of scenery and arena, uh, it'll be different. But I love who we are. Our locker room is, is tight. We're, we're coming together. I think it's just the right time that we have this stretch because it preps us for playoffs. I think this is what it's going to look like. Just you're probably playing the same team. But when it comes to the gratitude of the game and, and how special each game is, this road trip's gonna help us out a lot. Is there something to be said about you guys kind of getting on the road like a time for bonding and whatnot? Because I know you guys love each other, you know what I mean? But a chance to get out there and kind of us against the world mentality? It really is, and I think that's kind of how it's always been since just defending this championship. It's really been like it's us versus everybody. And when we can go on the road and still do that, um, it, it, some of the best games are on the road. We won our first championship on the road. So if we win there, uh, it, it's a pretty good chance that we're, we're good at where we are. And my last one on this, uh, Candace being out. Yeah. Like how much, to me, I, you can kind of see the difference with her not being out there. Yeah. How much is, is, of a difference is it with her not having her on the court to kind of help you guys out? Man, it's huge. It, it, it hurts sometimes because, you know, no one can do things that Candace Parker does. And when she's missing, it's a huge ingredient to our piece. But we kind of make it do what it do. I think we got a shout out to Kia definitely stepping in and being a pro and doing exactly what she needs to do. But we miss Candace. Uh, the game misses Candace, not just the aces. And so, uh, but we're going to always pray for her speedy recovery. And it was good seeing her at Commissioner Cup for sure. All right, cool. Are you going to get over here and get on this photo booth and do a little couple no, pictures and whatnot. You gonna get over there? Yeah, I saw a crown, so I think I might have to at this point. Ah, there you go. <laughs> Asia Wilson, the MVP, Defensive Player of the Year. She's gonna be the MVP this year. She can't say it, but I'm gonna go ahead and say it. Thank you, I appreciate you. Thank you, thank you so much. Uh, my girl, my girl. Thank you.